It is Wednesday, and you know what that means. What is going on everyone? Broken Mike here, and welcome along to the channel. And welcome along to this week's episode of BUW. And this is episode 130, and more importantly folks, this is the first show of the new year. And of course, as always, guys, we have got 10 matches for you in total, which will be spread across four separate parts. And that will include three huge championship matches. But we're going to get things started with a singles match on the men's division. It will be Lucas Hackett, representing the Woos Exclusive Society, going one-on-one -on -one with Johnny the Machine Cage, representing the Night Terrors. Who's going to get the win here? Let's find out. So if you guys do enjoy this one, then do make sure to leave a like for Mike, slap any comments down below, and of course do be sure to consider subscribing to the channel, and click on that notification bell to stay up to date with all things gaming, and all things BUW, as we try to get our target of 1400 subscribers And coming to you live, once again from London, England. And we're about to kick things off with the Hitman of the WES. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Little Rock, Arkansas. Weighing in at 231 pounds. Luke S. Pagan. And making his way down to the ring first, representing a Woos exclusive society, the hitman, Lucas Hackett. And of course, the last time we saw Lucas Hackett, he dropped the United Kingdom Championship, or shall we say, lost the championship to Mr. Nuts at Christmas Massacre. Lucas, of course, uh, was going into that match on a six-month unbeaten streak. Looking to bounce back. And his opponent making his way down to the ring, representing the Night Terrors, Johnny the Machine Cage. Of course, Johnny, of course, recently became a member of the Night Terrors after he took on Jack Styles. And what a match that was. He's got off to a good start with the Night Terrors. Of course, the uh, last time we saw him, he lost a steel cage match to Ian Berg at Christmas Massacre. Looking to get his new year off to a good start, as is Lucas Hackett. And with the Ruthless Rumble coming around the corner, everyone is going to make an impression, and here we go. And Lucas coming out the gates early. Whipping Johnny into the corner. You're not the only person to be looking to convince tonight. You 
And look at Lucas here. Beautiful move there. And a very DDT. Lucas with a couple of right hands. And what a backhand that one was. And that fourth backhand. And wait a second, he's... Oh, targeting the leg of Johnny. And that's a smart move, trying to take out the power game of the machine. Right hands, finding their mark. Waist lock. Into a German suplex. Lucas to the top rope. Elbow drop. Hooks the leg. And no! And Lucas questioning the referee's count there. That was very nearly a short night. For, for Johnny Cage. Johnny just hasn't got started. And look at this submission hold. Can Johnny find a way out of this? But I do not like the look of the positioning of Johnny's body. But he's able to get out of it. The lock up. And it... Shoulder breaker. And Lucas absolutely dominating Johnny here. And he's busted open the former YouTube champion. And Lucas, it's, it's just one way traffic at the moment. Oh, what a cutter! The stomp on the elbow into the cover. Well, it's a rope break. Johnny back up to his feet. Looking for a bit of offense. And there is a bit of offense. A tilt the well head scissors. Double underhook. Into a suplex. There's a kick. There's multiple strikes from Johnny. And he's busted open, Lucas. Both men busted open here. The nerve hold from Johnny Cage. Oh, wait a second. Lucas trying to find a way out. He does. The lock up again. Oh, and look at this strength here. The squat thrust. Delayed vertical suplex. Lucas calling Johnny. Well, to, trying to get him to his feet, perhaps, but maybe not. Goes into the cover. And another near fall for Lucas. A two count again. Oh, and looking for the air raid siren. But Johnny able to fight free. What will John, what's Johnny doing here? Power bomb! Hook of the leg! One count only! And Johnny can't believe it. Looking for a clothesline. Lucas with a counter. And Lucas looking for total carnage. But another counter from Johnny! Where's Johnny finding this energy? It's been one-way traffic for 95% of this match. But there's a springboard DDT from Johnny. But he's not done. Gut wrench, sit down, power bomb. And a two count for Johnny. What a match this is turning out to be. In the first match of 2023 in BUW, another gut wrench, sit down, power bomb. Thumbs up, thumbs down. Is Johnny about to seal the deal here? Calling Lucas back to his feet. Diving cross body. Johnny not done yet. Oh, and look at this. 
spikes Lucas onto his head. That could do it, but a fortunate break for Lucas. His foot was underneath the bottom rope. What a matchup this has been so far, and Lucas showing off momentarily. Could come back to bite him in the rear end. Springboard moonsault from Johnny. Hooks the leg. Oh no! Two count again for Johnny. What a match. This could. It's early days, but it already could be match of the night. And this is only the first match of the night. Oh, look at this, Johnny with the, with the submission hold, driving his knees into the back of Lucas Hackett. Can Lucas withstand this pain? And oh, Johnny lets him out, could be a mistake. A shot there from Lucas. And Lucas looking for it. Air Raid Siren. Hook of the leg. No! <laughs> oh my goodness, you've got to be kidding me. And Lucas can't believe that was only a two. But he's not waiting around. Will he hit it this time? Total carnage from Lucas Hackett. Hook of the leg. And Lucas is back to winning ways. What a wrestling match. Absolutely phenomenal. In the words of Lucas Hackett himself, so nice we get to see it twice. And that was the dear fall that nearly got him the win. But it was total carnage for Lucas. And here is your winner of the match, representing the Woos Exclusive Society. The Hitman, Lucas Hackett. And what a start to 2023 for that man. That was a statement win right there. What a matchup with Johnny Cage. Anyway, moving forwards to our next match. And it'll be our first match from the women's division for the new year. And this one, it will be Kayla. And she's going to go one on one with Brittany Beth representing the country lasses. And of course, she'll be accompanied to the ring by our tag team partner, Country Girl.
following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring from Cardiff, Wales, DVS K. Johnston. Making her way down to the ring first, Kayla. Of course, Kayla like to get back to winning championships again this year. It was a pretty decent year for Kayla last year, a three-time women's tag team champion. I'm sure at some point down the line this year, she'd love to win some singles gold. Opponent making her way down to the ring, being accompanied to the ring by Country Girl, representing the Country Lasses, Brittany Beth. And what a team these two are slowly becoming. And a couple of a tag team matches together and bagged themselves a couple of victories. This could be a Quickly fast rising team in BUW if they get their way. Of course, it's just going to be Brittany Beth in action this evening against the former three time women's tag team champion in Kayla. So it's a very stiff competition for Brittany. And a gut buster from Brittany Beth to get things started. Head first off the uh, turnbuckle and Brittany Beth taking charge of Kayla. Brittany into the cover. One count only and Brittany can't believe it. Brittany Beth now pulling away at the right arm of Kayla. Clubbing blow to the back. And a kick to the ribs. Right hands, left hands from Brittany Beth. And, oh, and Kayla with a counter. Brittany looking for an Alabama slam. And it delivers an STO. Nice delivery there from the devious one. Right hand, down goes Brittany. Hooks the leg. One count only. And Kayla can't believe it. Now Kayla, never a stranger of bending the rules. Choking out Brittany. Onto the ring apron. Heads to the top rope. And Kayla flies through the air and delivers an elbow drop. Right to the back, just as Brittany was getting back to her feet. She's got Brittany by the throat as Kayla slams her down. A stomp on the arm, and after a good start for Brittany, it's not looking so good at the moment. A camel clutch. And Brittany Beth to back to her vertical base and gets out of trouble. into a fireman's carry position snake eyes and Brittany now looking to choke out Kayla stomp on the knee right hand waist lock and a power bomb hooks the leg just a one count again and Brittany not for the first time, cannot believe it. Brittany Beth now heading to the top rope and delivers an elbow drop of her own. Follows up with a discus elbow drop. 
Right hands from Brittany Beth. And Kayla there with a the counter. Hooks the leg. Another one count. Kick to the back of Brittany Beth. And a basement drop kick to the spine. Oh, look at this. The disrespect from Kayla. Well, that's why she, they call her the devious one for nothing. I don't call her that for no reason, folks. Head into the top rope again. And again she flies once again, just as Brittany was getting back to her feet. Delivers an elbow drop to the spine. Hooks her leg again. And a two count for Kayla. And she can't believe it. Basement drop kick to the spine. And again, Brittany Breath getting choked out by the boot of Kayla. Oh, what a kick there from Kayla. Could be all she wrote. The kick to the gut. And there's a devious DDT. And that nonchalant cover. But it's a rope break. Brittany Beth's foot was underneath the bottom rope. Tough break for Kayla. Brittany Beth now. Alley up. Hooks the leg. And a two count for Brittany and she can't believe it. And Country Girl cheering on her partner at ringside. And there she goes over the top rope and ironically right in front of Country Girl. Country backing away. Elbow drop to the R to the leg and look at Kayla laughing. How dare she? The slap. Oh no, that got countered. Kick to the midsection from Kayla. Oh, just missed the ring post there. Right past Country Girl, lose. Trying to stay out of harm's way. Into the announce table. Back into the ring. Brittany Beth back up to a vertical base. Kayla get back, gets back in the ring. Into Fireman's carry position. Oh, and Kayla, Kayla, Kayla! Oh, no! She just got power bombed right to the floor. How devastating that was. Right hands from Brittany Beth. Sends Kayla into the ring apron. And again, pulling away at the arm. Right hands from Brittany. The chop, rights, lefts. Oh, look out. Fisherman's brain buster. Right on the outside. The outside, that's Finn padding on the outside. And there's a headbutt from Brittany Beth. So like her version of a Glasgow kiss. The lock up. Into the ring apron again she goes. Right hand. Waist lock. Kayla with an elbow. Kayla back inside. Brittany getting back in the ring herself now. Oh, Kayla trying to dish out some offense. But Brittany Beth with a counter. Accordion rack. Look at this. That's not how the body's supposed to bend. And Brittany Beth just took out Kayla. No. no. It isn't over. It's two and Brittany's questioning the referee on the count. Brittany Beth perhaps setting up for the finish. Oh, counter from Kayla lands on her feet. She gets slapped. 
And look at this delayed vertical suplex attempt here. Nicely done there. Discus elbow drop. Brittany into the cover. And again, Kayla kicks out. Unbelievable. Another discus elbow drop. Another match of the night candidate already, folks. And another accordion rack. Will Kayla tap here? Kayla's in deep, deep trouble. Oh, she lets her out. Could be a mistake. Oh, Kayla with the counter. What a match. And again, Kayla insulting her opponent with laughter. Oh, Kayla gets out of dodge. Chop block to the knee. And another thrust kick to the to the to the chin, and again Kayla looking for that devious DDT. There it is, and and again Kayla has an unlucky break, rope break for the second time after she hits that devious DDT splash. Brittany in a lot of trouble. Kayla taking a long time to make the pin attempt. And Kayla starts off 2023 with a win. What a wrestling match though, folks. You, you can't take anything away from either one of these ladies. What a matchup. There was that accordion rack into the slam. We thought that was it for Kayla. Here is your winner, TBS K Johnston. So here is your winner of the match, Kayla. And of course, what a way to kick off her new year. Ruthless Rumble just around the corner, as I said, folks. Just a few weeks away. Could she be the one this year? We'll have to wait and see. Anyway, folks, moving on to our next match. And it'll be our final match of this opening part to BUW. We have another singles match this time from the men's division. And we have got... The Dark Dominator, Jack Styles, representing the Night Terrors. And he's going to go one on one with one half of the BUW Intercontinental Tag Team Champions, David Labby, representing the Woos Exclusive Society. Of course, we saw on last week's show, we saw Joseph Conlin get a win over the Minion. Can David Labby do the same to Jack Styles. We are about to find out. Mind you, it's not been a good start for the Night Terrors in 2023. As we saw Johnny Cage uh, lose earlier on to Lucas Hackett. Maybe they could turn things around with a Jack Styles win. Scheduled for one fall 
making his way to the ring, representing the Terrors from Leeds, England. Weighing in at 312 pounds, the Dominator, Jack Styles. Making his way down to the ring first, representing the Night Terrors, the Dark Dominator, Jack Styles. And of course, Jack Styles also the owner of JSW recently put on a great event fairly recently Day of Dawn great event if you hadn't seen it I definitely recommend checking it out I mean when you instantly look into Jack Styles eyes you wouldn't necessarily think he was a uh, wrestling promoter but he is. Jack Styles, of course, a former Intercontinental Tag Team Champion with Dominion, want their titles back, and they will have an opportunity to do so at the Ruthless Rumble. Making his way down to the ring, representing the Woos Exclusive Society, one half of the BUW Intercontinental Tag Team Champions, David Labby. And of course, David Labby alongside Joseph Connolly won their first titles in BUW at Christmas Massacre just a few weeks ago. It was a long time coming for David Labby to win his first championship in BUW, and he finally has it. The champ planning to show his dominance in this division with an emphatic win tonight. <laughs> it's going to be a big night for the WES, that's for sure. We've seen Lucas Hackett get his new year off to a good start with a victory over Johnny the Machine Cage. And of course we will see later on the head of the Woos Exclusive Society, the BUW World Champion, Mr. Woos, defend his world title later on this evening. And David Labby sends Jack into the corner. A face wash there for Jack Styles, not once but twice. I wonder if Jack Stoll's New Year's going to entail more, taking more limbs from people, but wait a second, cover! Two count only for David Labby. It's a warning there to Jack Stiles. DDT! Let's not forget, Jack is a former two-time world champion as well. Has held countless championships here in BUW. And he's going to fly double axe handle. And at the moment it's been all David Labby. And David Labby choking out Jack. And a stomp on the elbow. It's been all one way traffic again. Just like we saw in the opening contest. For, for a majority of the match we saw... Uh, we saw Lucas Hackett completely decimate Johnny the Machine Cage for the most part of that match before a, a late flurry from Johnny the Machine nearly giving Johnny a win. And there goes David over the top rope. And Jack clubbing blow to the back of the head. A bit of offense there from Jack Styles. And there's a nerve hold, but it will be called for a rope break. Oh no, Jack. Oh no, he's biting him. He's biting Labby. 
Jack with a pit attempt but in the rope break and you hear the fans break his fingers I was going to say is Jack going to have a taste for human flesh in 2023 well that answers our question Jack starts with an elbow drop another rope break Jack can't believe it there's a pendulum bat breaker stretch from Jack Styles. oh wait a second Jack oh my oh my goodness he's deadlifting David Labby look at this Ma military press David Labby lands on his face into the cover not even a one count wait a second Jack Styles with a power bomb and then the knee to the face Jack Stoll's tossing David Labby around like a sack of potatoes. Heads to the top rope. Jack with the elbow. A clothesline attempt. No. David Labby duped us. Oh, right hand from Jack. The waist lock. What a slam. That was a unique slam there from Jack Styles. Into the cover. And a two count only for Jack. Labby answering back with lefts and rights. Shot to the midsection. Sends Jack into the corner. Sits him up on the top rope. What's he... What's David Labby thinking here? Oh, look at this. DDT off the top rope. Are you kidding me? Will this do? No, it will not. Two count for David Labby, and he cannot believe it. Look at it. For the seek and destroy. Hooks the legs. And no. Jack kicks out. How often do we see anyone kick out of the Seek and Destroy and you can hear the fans chanted fight forever. What great action we've already seen in this first edition of BUW in 2023. Jack Styles catches Labby with ease. Drops a knee. And he's got, Jack's got David by the throat again. He tosses him across the ring. Jack Styles with the right hands. The right hand from Labby, the waist lock. Amateur takedown. And David Labby in the corner, taunting a bit too much. And David with the counter. Oh, a clap, bit sort of a bump there. And David Labby with a Canadian net breaker. A stomp on the knee and there's a heel hook locked in a kick to the head right hands lock up suplex into the cover but it's a rope break David Labby onto the ring apron. Heads to the top. He's going to fly. Elbow drop. No one home. Jack rolled out the way. 
And David Lowy's a precarious spot. Electric chair drop. Jack shoots the half, looking to get the win. And it's another rope break. I, I won't be honest, we've seen quite a few rope breaks here and already this evening. Jack Styles with a headbutt. Into the cover. One count only. Jack can't believe it. David rolled the shoulder up. And Jack, is he going to fly? We've seen big men fly before. Oh, he ops against it. Waste slot from David Labby, the full Nelson. Jack with a counter. Oh, what a super kick from Jack Styles! And there it is, the Brody Lee close line. And David Labby rolls the shoulder up. Can you believe it? the fans you can hear it holy crap indeed Jack's on the fly again elbow drop and there's a headbutt from Labby will this do it and Jack kicks out this is unbelievable ladies and gents <laughs> This is the first three matches of the new year and they've all been bangers. Jack Stiles showing his reckless, well his ruthless streak I should say, cover. And Jack Stiles gets the victory. What a wrestling match again. What a banger. We've seen three classic matches in the first part of BUW for this year. Unbelievable. Banger after banger after banger as the brawling brutes would say. Here is your winner, the Dominator, Jack Styles. So here is your winner of the match representing the Night Terrors, the Dark Dominator, Jack Styles and one for one for the Night Terrors here tonight and of course one for one over the New Intercontinental Tag Champions as well in recent weeks anyway folks that is going to be your lot for this first part of BUW and what's a, what a first part we have seen the 2023 we're going to see a lot more as well hope you're going to get in your popcorn and that stuff ready for the next few parts because it's going to be amazing anyway if you guys have enjoyed this one then do make sure to drop a like for mike slap any comments down below and please do consider subscribing to the channel as i'm trying to hit my next target of 1400 subscribers or in this i'm going to put it in another way 1400 but anyway folks thank you all so much for watching do take care and i will see you all after this first break